Perudua is in discussions with the government to participate in the realization of the third national car project. Its president and CEO, Dato Zainal Abidin Ahmad, on Thursday said Perudua has the capacity to be a possible contract manufacturer for the project. As national car, we will work together with the MC, uh, the kind of support that we can give and then the kind of idea that we can give to government so that we can work together. Kita ada 185 vendors, eh? whoever, Proton ke, or third national car ke, they can, they can buy from our vendors, they can use. But these vendors, kita dah train dia, you know, to become a good uh, quality uh, producer of, of parts. Lah. So those are an example of the kind of collaboration yang kita akan buat. Lah. Back in February, former Prime Minister Tun Dr. Mahathir Mohamad said a prototype for the third national car was ready and that the government was waiting for private investors to invest in the project. Uh, third national car, saya mencadangkan supaya uh, pengurusan uh, Pro2 dan juga Daihatsu dapat uh, membentangkan satu taklimat kepada kerajaan pentadbiran baru. Uh, saya percaya ini adalah tujuan untuk meningkatkan kemahiran uh, precision engineering di kalangan engineers kita satu usaha yang baik sebab kita dah identified uh, the, the platform yang akan kita gunakan kita dah kenal pasti the developer yang akan membangunkan uh, usaha ini Precision to see the car still on? Setakat ini tidak ada keputusan yang sebalik ini it was previously reported that Dream Edge Sandram Barhat, the anchor company to drive the third national car project, was aiming to unveil its first prototype by March this year. Earlier, Mari, Perodua, the Perodua Suppliers Association and Perodua Dealers Association signed a memorandum of understanding to collaborate and create new employment opportunities for 1,000 local talents. The MOU also included reskilling and re-employment of the displaced Malaysian talents due to the economic impact of the COVID-19 pandemic.